Hello guys, Mr. Dynamon2050 here, and today I'm going to be showing you about the difference, well, just really between the size of a file and actually, this, and actually the size of a file on the disk. Now, if you go to a file and click properties, you will see it'll say size and size on disk. And quite a few people have asked me what difference between these actually are, because quite frankly, sometimes the size on disk is bigger and sometimes it's smaller. And so people, some people think that compressing files can kind of reduce the size of files uh, on the disk and stuff. It's just been quite confusing for me quite frankly reading some of these emails so today I'm just going to clarify what the difference is now first of all just the best kind of demonstrate that I'm just going to close that I'm going to go to start and computer I'm actually just going to tap my phone out there and just put a flash stick in just a one gig flash stick and once it pops up it should pop up relatively quickly it's just a flash stick now as you can see got a gig on here if I right click and press properties now um, right. If I right click and click format, you'll see that you'll have an allocation unit size. And you know, you can choose, you can choose 512 bytes, 1024 bytes, which is a KB, that by the way, um, 2048 bytes, which is 2 KB, and it goes on and on and on and on and on. Now, you'd probably realize that you know, this has got something got to do with it, and this has got something to do with it. And first of all, I just want to say, the higher you have this, typically the faster it can be formed in terms of, you know, copying and pasting files to the actual flash stick and to your PC and whatnot. The higher this is, the faster it can transfer files. However, it writes in these blocks. So when you write a file, say if you're writing a song, 8 megabytes for example, it is going to be writing a load of like, say, say if we select, I don't know, 32 kilobytes there. When we write a file, it's going to be writing 32 kilobytes, 32 kilobytes, 32 kilobytes, and if the song finishes, so so you finish writing the song to a flash stick, and the, the last block, as again, it's going to be 32 kilobytes, but if you want it to actually, you know, if, if, if the song wants to write like another 2 kilobytes, you're going to have that 30 kilobytes, um, you know, just wasted, and that's why the size on disk is typically larger because of the allocation unit size. Now, this is how you can typically change it. So you can kind of get more storage on on a storage medium. Now, if you go to format, you can see that the allocation size is here. Now, typically I would always choose the highest one because number one, this is a gig flash stick, it's quite a big size. Now, I don't use flash sticks. I, I have a few a thousand gig hard drives all, all over the shop, but I usually put this to the highest so that I can copy and paste the fastest because that's what I want. So I just click start on there, it'll change it to that. And uh, yeah, I'm nice and happy. Wonderful. I actually don't know what's on that flash deck. I hope uh, nothing presses is on there. But uh, yeah, <laughs> I, I don't think anything was on there of my um, need, I think. But uh, yeah, that's the difference, guys, between the size on disk and the size. So basically, when you copy and paste a file, if the allocation unit size Say if you've got a block of 64 and it want, wants to write like, um, uh, say two kilobytes, then you've got, um, you know, you've got like a part of that block wasted and is empty, and that's uh, where the size on disk comes in. And there you are. That's a very long, quick format. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope it's helped you in a kind of way. And uh, yeah, please feel free to like, comment, and also subscribe.